Hello friends, welcome back. Uh, this is our practical number six. In this practical, we have uh, take the main function of the date and time. That means in this practical, we have to cover how to use the date, how to use the time, and how to by forget the date and time. Okay, let's start the practical. So, so first, uh, I go to the tag. Okay, I make the tag uh, complete date. My complete date. I make the data type is uh, date and time. Okay, then I want to make a uh, what is the today date uh, means DD. Okay, I make it. Uh, this property is. This is very important. You may have to make the property as a uh, string. Okay. Then today uh, DD today yum yum. That means uh, we can see the data in DD yum yum in YY format. I make like this today DD yum yum and this one is uh, y, 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 y. Okay. So first we uh, see the how to uh, uh, so the date that means the how to read the current date and time by using the VB script. You can check here. Uh, here is a also uh, you can see the date and time of the current date and time. So I go to the VB script screen. Okay. So uh, we want to read the tag. So first I want to read the complete date. So so I make it like this. Uh, this is our smart tag is equal to uh, now the function is now you can see check here the function is now okay this function is give is the complete uh, you can see the here is a indicate return the current date and current time from the system date and system time setting on your computer that means our system uh, date and time can be moved on this tag okay i hope you are understanding okay let's uh, okay now we go and uh, okay we have to first design the screen so i go here and design current and date and time okay this is our current date and time then i want to read like this uh, dd oblique mm oblique why why okay so we go to the, our text system uh, here is our complete date date and time this is very important sometime you need to by forget the this uh, time into suppose you need the only dd only date or uh, sometime you need the only minutes sometime only you need the years so for that this is very important uh, practical uh, so okay so today dd okay so today dd and then today yum yum okay today month so okay and then uh, year so we make like this and into this sign here okay and this is also also to here so i hope this is okay okay so uh, we go to the script scene so we have may make a only scripting for the only read the current date and time okay let us see and check okay we go to the runtime and we check okay now see here is a by default uh, i don't know why this is showing here okay i go to and execute the script now you can check here one uh, this is a month this is a date and this is a year now 11 11 35 uh, am this is actually time okay if i if we execute the script continuously then we can see uh, the time is 
continuously changing okay uh, so now we want to make it separate that means we want to uh, make a separate uh, dd and mmyy so we go to the tag and today dd then okay today mm today month that means that and today year okay this this we can uh, represent like as the function uh, okay this is a tag take day this is one function okay day and but how to use this you you can see here there is a syntax how to use the day function uh, we make the here the tag name uh, my comma complete date that means we uh, for this uh, from this tag we have to only uh, separate out the only day okay similarly for the for the month month and same tag we have to use that means that we have separate uh, separate out the month from this uh, complete date and time similarly we have to use the uh, okay my mistake similarly we have to use the year for year uh, we have the uh, uh, year this is the all function near about 100 plus function uh, we have so we can see here the year this is the year syntax uh, sorry function and we uh, we have to tell him to where from where to it it should be uh, spread out the uh, that year that means the take out the date year okay up to this is okay now make it compile compiling okay then make it run time okay now see see this is uh, actually the our current system my system, my computer current system date and time here uh, is the date is 3 month is 1 and year is 2023 okay well, i hope you are enjoying this video thank you for watching the video if you have any query any doubt my whatsapp number is given on uh, description box please contact me once again if you are not subscribed to my channel requesting you to please subscribe the channel okay thank you for watching the video okay welcome back friends uh, now we are uh, already seen the uh, date fu date function so now we can uh, choose the uh, time function so so first we want to read the uh, time from the our com uh, from this our system so i go to first i need to make a tag for the time uh, my complete time my complete my, my complete time and then we need, we we want to hh hours then the minutes and then ss seconds so we have make a uh, make it down we have make add these three four tag okay so i go to the screen uh, first i make the screen uh, complete current date and time so i make it copy paste okay here is only time okay here is our system is current time so now what we say uh, i make the where is my complete time okay this is our tag for the complete time then we want to make like hours minute last one is second C O U my spelling mistake. Oh my god. Yes, P C O Okay, you can write shortcut like as second. So mm, this is okay. Uh, so where is our today? No hours. Okay, this is 
hour okay this is uh, minutes hours minutes and where is this is our second okay okay now up up to this our uh, this part of the uh, uh, time is ready for that means our screen is ready so now we have to write the scripting so we go to the scripting function and here we want to read the time so i go uh, to the tag my complete time my complete time equal to we call the function like as time time is function please remember first every time when you want to spread out the that means the spread out the hours minute and second separately then first we, we you have to convert uh, that uh, current system time into the take it in our your tag okay then we uh, we want to re read the hour hour is equal to okay the new function is okay this is function of hours make it copy sorry make it and uh, my complete time okay this is our perfect syntax okay we, we take out the hours separately then we take out the minutes uh, separately so also there is a function for the minutes okay minutes okay this is a minute function uh, this function is take out the minute separately from this uh, tag okay okay this up to this is okay similarly we want to take out the second from the complete time then the our second is like as there is a function for the take it out second okay i hope so i make it writing perfectly second okay up to this our uh, is uh, date and time complete uh, program scripting is uh, i have written here for this uh, we have used the date and for this we have used the time okay so let us check what uh, what uh, result will be show in our scripting we make it go into run time okay uh, this is a uh, by default Siemens uh, showing the this format i don't know why showing okay make it scripting okay okay you can say our current date and time is uh, first month uh, today day is 3 uh, or 2013 year 11 o'clock 45 minute and 52 second am so uh, you can see i can make it out dd yy format so date is 3 uh, month is 1 and year is 2030 2023 similarly for the time you can see the there is only time uh, here is a complete date and time and here is only current time so current time is 11 o'clock 44 minute and 52 seconds so uh, I, I i i make it separately so hours is equal to 11 minutes is equal to 45 and second is equal to 52 i hope you are enjoying this video if you have any doubt regarding the this function and the other uh, other things please uh, whatsapp me my whatsapp number already given in uh, description box uh, thank you for watching the once again uh, thank you for watching the video if you are not subscribed to my channel requesting you to please subscribe to my channel okay bye bye